if probability favors the existence of aliens, why haven't we observed any? So, um, what you mean by probability favors the existence of aliens, I, I guess you mean, and I'd agree with you, that the universe is so big. I mean, we just said that there is something like one with 20 two noughts after it stars in the observable universe. We now know that most of those um, have planetary systems. Um, certainly, if you look in the Milky Way, uh, which we can do in our own galaxy, basically everywhere we look, we find planets around the stars. So let's say that most of them have solar systems. So it is inconceivable that there will not be life and I think civilizations out there amongst the stars. Um, but. The question becomes, first of all, what form does that life take? So in the solar system, we know there's only one place, Earth, which has complex life uh, and certainly a civilization like ours. It, it could well be that there are microbes um, below the surface on Mars today, or there may have been microbes on Mars in the past when Mars had rivers and lakes and quite possibly oceans for a few hundred million years. Um, so there, there could have been Martians but they would have been little microbes or bacteria-like things uh, at best, I think. Um, on the moons of Jupiter and Saturn, like Europa, there are oceans below the surface and we think the conditions are right for life to have started, but we don't know because we haven't been there. So if there are aliens in our solar system, there'll be little single-celled things waiting for us to find them. Uh, some of you might discover them actually because we are building missions to Mars, we'll be sending humans to Mars, certainly in your lifetime, and one of the things you'll be doing is looking for microbes below the surface. So maybe we'll find Martians.